Hi, Jackie here. I'm the manager of therapeutic programming for AFA. And for this weekend's activity tip, we're going to be exploring virtual fashion shows. Now, if you've seen a fashion show in person or on television, usually they are these amazing models that are walking down the runway, everyone's snapping photos, they're wearing these extravagant outfits, maybe feathers and frills. It's really, these virtual fashion shows are really anything that you wanna make it. You can make it as funny as you want with maybe mixing and matching some crazy designs, or you can be totally serious about it and you can wear Hollywood's finest. It's really up to you. Now, the first step in creating your virtual fashion show is organizing what time and who's gonna participate. So. Uh, definitely maybe grab a pad, jot down some friends, family, loved ones, maybe some grandchildren, nieces, nephews that want to hop on and have some fun. And organize a time when you want to participate in this virtual fashion show. Uh, maybe discuss um, as a team what kind of fashion you want to go into. Maybe you want to do athleisure. Maybe you want to do... Um, something where it only embraces one color. You know, all these themes are endless and you can do these fashion shows as many times as you want, really. Then you have to go to your closet and pick out all these outfits. So maybe you wanna do something with polka dots. Maybe you wanna do something with frills. Whatever you wanna do. You can grab your scarf, you can grab your hat, and you can put on your show. <laughs> So once you have all of that organized, find some space in your house where you can set up your computer or your tablet. Um, hop on the video chat and then host your fashion show. And the best part about some of these video conferencing apps like Zoom is that you can actually record it. So you can record your fashion show and then you can share it with others and you can, it can be this way that you can connect with everyone in a fun and playful way. So um, I hope this activity tip was fun and helpful for you. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. Also, if you have any questions about anything or if you need a resource, you can reach out to our Helpline social workers. They're available to you seven days a week. Um, have a wonderful weekend, and I'll see you next time. Bye.